My name is Walter Latimer. So I was born here in Miami, uh, and I have been living here for most of my life. I left for two years to go to college in Chicago. Went to high school down the street. I went to an arts high school uh, where I studied graphic design. Didn't really pursue computer science or programming um, like I wanted to, and I kind of lost that for a number of years. Came back to Miami because I couldn't afford school in Chicago anymore. Uh, it was an expensive school. I, I loved what I was doing there, but I just, I really couldn't afford it anymore. When I left school, I was addicted to drugs and about to file for bankruptcy. Uh, I dropped out of school four times and destroyed my credit and my GPA. At that point, I realized that I needed to kind of get my life together. Uh, I was looking at a meetup group on meetup.com and I came across the lab's website and saw that WinCode was going to be opening in like two weeks. So I jumped on that opportunity and got my application, interviewed with Joe and Yuha within a day. I'm most prepared we've ever been for this. Uh, every cohort just keeps on getting better and better. Uh, the students have worked super hard these last nine weeks. Three months ago, when I signed up for WinCode, I expected to make a change in my life, but I didn't expect to make as significant of a change in my life as I actually have. I thought I was just going to kind of get a, you know, get an entry level job in tech and, you know, maybe be moderately more content with my life and maybe a little bit more financially secure, but uh, it really opened up so many doors for me. WinCode is so awesome because it has a team that listens to its students. It has a team that responds well to criticism and adapts very, very quickly in a way that I never saw happening when I was in college. Not every uh, dropout story is uh, as glamorous as leaving an Ivy League school to pursue a venture. And, um, and, and that certainly wasn't my story. So when I left school for the fourth time, I was a drug addict. And it took, uh, like I said, four schools and uh, an HIV diagnosis for me to realize that I needed to get my act together. Um, and at that point, I had completely destroyed my credit, I had destroyed my GPA, and going back to school for a fifth time just wasn't an option. And that is how, that's how I ended up at WinCode. And the amazing part is that everyone at WinCode is some sort of outlier, is exceptional. And I came here thinking I was going to learn how to code, and what I really got was an airtight community. And I got an amazing group of friends here. I've met moms uh, with kids who want to re-enter the workforce. I've met Ivy League graduates who, uh, who just want a new challenge. I've met high school dropouts. I have met poker players. I have met uh, YouTube partners. It's, everyone here is just incredible. I've met some of the best friends of my life here. Um, and if you had told me 15 months ago that uh, I would not be making $10 an hour anymore, but instead I would be uh, working in Silicon Valley for the man who invented the self-driving car, I would have told you that you were crazy. I have a tradition where every year for New Year's I wear uh, a, a crazy all-over print outfit, and one of my students saw the outfit and dared me to wear it to Cohort 4's pitch day, and um, I don't think they thought I was going to do it, and I, I wore it to pitch day. And it kind of became a little bit of a mini tradition where I would come to every pitch day wearing some sort of crazy outfit. Yeah, being at WinCode is definitely a 24-hour commitment, but the it, it doesn't feel like that as much because you're loving what you're doing the whole time. So as a student, you find yourself here at the lab until you know midnight, one in the morning, working. Uh, but you you love what you're working on. You're staying not because you feel like you just like will get in trouble if you don't finish. You stay because you like you just really want to see those tests pass. The app that I was most proud to build at WinCode was the app I built. Uh, I built a Minesweeper game uh, right after my first week of WinCode. So it was one of the very first. Actually, it was the first thing I ever built at WinCode, uh, and it got me to realize that I could build complex applications. And the other app that I was extremely proud to build at WinCode was my final project, Good Measure, with Brian Perez and Julie Kramer, which uh, was a an app to help manage um, student homework here at WinCode. And it actually got acquired by WinCode uh, a few months later, and we still use it to date, and it has gone through a number of evolutions and iterations. It's bittersweet because I will be leaving this community soon. I just recently accepted a position as a course developer for Udacity, 
They are a uh, company that teaches people how to code uh, in an online environment on a massive scale. And um, I'm very excited. If you're thinking about learning to code, it can be a bit scary to get started. It's, there's a lot of information out there and trying to figure out where to start is, um, it can be overwhelming. And my advice would be to just start doing it because once you get the ball rolling, things start to fall into place, but you have to work hard at it. You have to decide that this is what you really want to be doing. And if you make that decision and you flip that switch in your mind and just give it all you've got, there's no way that you can't be successful. I really love about WinCode was that they never once judged me for any of the mistakes I had made in my life. And if anything embraced me for who I was coming into the program and taught me to really appreciate the skills that I brought to the table. Thank every single person at WinCode, uh, from the co-founders Joe and Yuha, to Ed, the lead instructor, to Diego, uh, my ride or die here at WinCode, to all of the students here. Uh, it's really the community of students that has made this such a positive experience for me here and uh, will continue to be you know, the backbone of WinCode.